I'm Patrick Musiri of the Institute of Biotechnology Research. Mushroom production or training was started in the year 2006 because people kept asking. So uh, the management of the university decided to start this program because there was a gap, there was a need for training people on how to grow mushrooms as a business. Farmers in Kenya are growing four types of mushroom, buttons, oyster, shiitake, and ganodam. So from the people we have trained, about 50% of those are growing mushroom commercially. And the most popular mushroom in this country is the buttons. The demand is upwards of 50 tons a month. So the farmers are doing about 20 to 30 tons a month. So we still have a gap of about 10 tons that is an unmet. The oyster is the first second. Farmers are doing only three to five tons a month. Shiitake is also becoming very popular because it's also medicinal. And uh, where farmers are only doing about 100 kilos, so there's a demand about, about 500 kilos per month. Gandama is wholly medicinal. And uh, the production in this country is about 50 kilos only. So there's a big demand and the, the requirement will be about 200 kilos per month. So we encourage farmers to grow mostly the shiitake, the buttons, and the Ganodama. Mushroom growing it raises agricultural risks. So we select the agricultural risk to match the mushroom. So the first process will be composting, which will take about a month. Then there will be the pasteurization to kill off the harmful microorganisms in the substrate or the media. Then we spoon, we add the mushroom seeds into the substrate. It will take about a month for the spoon to grow. So after two months, the mushrooms will start fruiting. It creates a climate, the right climate for growth. So we are going to harvest this mushroom for two months. After two months, now we have harvested enough. Uh, so we throw away the substrate and start again. The beneficials for the mushroom growing are many because the farmers are benefiting because they are getting money from the exercise. The people who sell the agricultural waste because mushroom growing it raises agricultural waste. So the people who sell the agricultural waste to the farmers are also benefiting. The environment is benefiting because uh, we have a greener environment because we are utilizing agricultural waste instead of burning. So the tourists, the hotels, the supermarkets, and the green grocers are also benefiting. The g community is also benefiting because all the mushrooms that we are growing here as a demo, in this demo house, is sold to the g staff. Mushrooms are beneficial to our health. They are nutritious. So mushrooms are also, do, do also have medicinal value like the shiitake and the ganodama. Mushrooms do not have cholesterol. They have protein upwards of that percent. Uh, they are also rich in minerals, so they are very good for people who want to keep healthy. Mushrooms are a good replacement for red meat.